The universe is infinite with the wonders within it equally as infinite and beautiful. Which is why it is the most amazing that with the right tech you and I can very easily locate extraordinary deep space objects within the comfort of your own room. A normal non-computerized telescope can be a very good tool for seeing objects in space however, without any guidance to point them in the right direction, most struggle to locate planets and deep space objects they want to see. In this video, we will discuss the top 5 best computerized telescope in current market. So let's get started. Number 5. Skywatcher FlexTube 300. The Skywatcher 1-2 collapsible is definitely a very big device, weighing in at around 30 to 40 kilograms according to Amazon but, the optics and of course the computerized aspect of it, it's a scope that'll definitely be worth the price if you invest the money. The aperture of the system is 1-2 which roughly translates to 303 mm, a focal length of 1,500 mm and a focal ratio of f-4.9, the initial view that you'll have through the scope will be very wide but also very detailed, which is something I'm sure you'd appreciate from the Skywatcher 1-2. The mount used for the scope is a motorized go-to mount which will point the scope to wherever you want it to as long as it pertains to the database of 42, 900 plus objects. The mod also comes with a dual encoder design which will allow you to move the telescope manually if that's what you want to do without needing to constantly realign the scope. Number 4. Celestron Nexstar 6SA. The Nexstar 6SE is a very popular device among astronomers and is generally the middle ground for individuals looking to get into astronomy due to its smaller frame and solid optics. This device will set you back around $800 to $1,000 so it's more affordable than the Skywatcher 1-2 but it's still relatively expensive. 6SE uses a schmidt cassegrain design for its scope which means that it's basically a mix between a refractor and reflector scope but, without any of the major inherent problems such as a high maintenance from a reflective scope or the chromatic aberration from a refractor. This means that the 6SE will be a very competent scope and the design itself also allows for no loss of focal length with the compact design of the tube that T has. This is of course very solid, once again, when you consider the telescope's portability. Number 3. Celestron Nexstar 130 SLT. The Nexstar 130 SLT is a significantly more affordable, costing $350 to $500, variant than the Nexstar 6SA, being the entry-level level Nexstar product line and all, without compromising too much in the sense of power although the 130mm lens does mean that it's a fair bit weaker. The specs of the 130SLT are a 130mm aperture, 650mm focal length, which means that the focal ratio is at f-5. As the system is also a reflector scope, this does mean you'll need to maintain the optics on regular basis as they are exposed. All in all, the biggest complaints with the scope are that the eyepieces are a little too cheap out of the box, this is easily fixable if you purchase new ones and the battery consumption of the systems means the longevity of the go-to motor is very poor. Besides these points, the Nexstar 130 SLT is a solid entry-level go-to mount scope. Number 2. Celestron CPC Deluxe 1100. The computerized scope is yet another system made by Celestron and it's among the most expensive on this list setting you back $3.5,000 to $4.5,000 but, it's also amongst the most powerful and efficient systems on this list, which definitely does make it a device to consider. The aperture of the lens is 280mm, a focal length of 2,800mm which means you'll be left with a focal ration of f-10. This of course means that the magnification displayed by the lens when using the same eyepieces as other telescopes will translate to be much higher. As for the max magnification, it stands at 551x. The tube used is a Edge HD optical system which is Celestron's proprietary and premium optical system for their scopes. The benefits to this design is that it corrects both coma and field curvature, resulting in aberration-free images even when using the widest of eyepieces. Number 1. Orion SkyQuest XT8G. The Orion XT8G is a system with a 203mm aperture lens, a focal length of 1200mm making a focal ratio of f-5.9, 
the X-T8G has very solid specs. When you factor in the price tag, which is only around $900 to $1,300 for the specs you get and of course the go-to computerized mount, the SkyQuest is a value-packed device. The accessories in the box includes a DeepView 28mm, 42x, and Plusl 12.5mm, 96x, an Easy Finder 2, two dual-speed Crayford and a database of over 42k data of objects to view through the DC servo motors with encoders go to mount. In terms of the max magnification with the SkyQuest, you'll be able to see it 400x which means you'll be able to see Jupiter, star clusters and other faint celestial objects like the Orion Nebulae and the Hercules clusters at a very detailed and mesmerizing level when looked through with a powerful eyepiece. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you liked this video and found some important information what you want.